Welcome back guys, thanks for joining me for another beer review. Slightly different view today, it looks like this could be the one that I end up going with until I get my background sorted in other places. Uh, yeah, light's good. So, we are back with another beer review uh, and we are taking a look at another one that I picked up from Lakes Bruco, uh, or the order that I placed with them. Uh, now this one is a sour. It's the triple fruited sour and this is their three berry pie coming in at 7% ABV, lovely looking artwork on the can. 440ml can, and this come in, not a cheap one, £5.75. Now I do know sours are, they do cost a bit more to produce, so uh, you know, I guess that's not too bad a price. Now, uh, on the back here, I was, I was gonna say, oh, I got this from Trebly Madness. Of course I didn't, I just told you I got it from Lakes Bruco. Idiot. Uh, on the back here, it says loaded with blueberries, blackberries, and cherries, and topped off with a touch of vanilla. Uh, so yeah, hopefully it's gonna be interesting. I'll give you another quick look at the can. Uh, before we crack it open, it's going in the Lakes Brew Co glass, obviously. That was the whole point of buying it, so I could do these beers in that. And unfortunately, Baz is in his uh, works gear. So even though he's reviewed a few of these beers already, he still hasn't worn the t-shirt. Right, just come out of the fridge, been in the fridge for a while. It's gonna be at about five degrees, something like that. Let's see what we get. It's looking very, it's looking very cherry berry, blackberry, blueberry and all that lot. It looks quite thick as well, to be honest. Looks like it's got a bit of body to it. Still some left in the can. I will leave it there. I had the can upside down as well, so hopefully it shouldn't shouldn't change too much. I want to get the rest in. So look at that. Absolutely. Black, blackberry, blueberry, cherry looking colour. I'm seeing nothing through there. It looks quite thick, to be honest. We've got a finger of a deep pink. Should we say deep pink? I can't think what the colour would be uh, off the top of my head, but yeah, we'll go with that. Looks decent, looks like a sour. Let's dive in with the nose and see what we get. Wow, yeah. Very much sort of pastry, pastry sour for me. You get that sort of pastry, pastry note in there, vanilla. Massive hit of blueberries. And I think, I think it's the blueberry is the biggest sort of thing on the nose, along with sort of like the vanilla and the sort of pastry feel that you get from it, followed by the cherries and the blackberries is, is more like a, a bit of a backup thing right at the back end for me. And it has got a tartness about it on the nose. So without further ado, we'll give this a little bit of a top of Rooney. And uh, a sour isn't, it's it's a style that's grown on me. This This smells pretty tart. This does smell pretty tart. I'm kind of getting the feeling that it's going to have a Vault City feel about it. But at 575, hopefully it's going to be decent. So let's dive in. Three berry pie from Lakes Bruco, out of Kendall, by the way. Cheers. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. The first thing that went through my head though was not massively sour. The sourness is there and the tartness is there. But we'll do my other stuff first. Uh, like I said, I kind of expected it to be like a, a sort of typical Vault City ones. So it's a little bit safe for me. But let's crack on. The body's nice. Again, for me, it's gone down that sort of Vault City route. Quite a decent body. Not chewy like you get from, say, some of the Vault City ones, uh, but it's got a decent body to it. And it is sour. It is, it is becoming a little bit more tart the more you drink it. Carbonation is minimal. It's there, but it's a little sprightly fizz in the background. Uh, lovely and smooth, lovely and soft. It 
yeah, nice mouthfeel, not massively heavy, like I say, nice and smooth and soft. The tartness is coming in, sprightly fizz. On the taste, on the taste, for me, starts off with that sort of sugary pastry feel, the vanilla in there. It's almost like for me, as if you, you're sort of biting into something like this. You're getting the, the slight sweetness, the pastry sort of feel, the vanilla. And then behind that, that's when all the all the berries and cherries and blackberries and blueberries all start coming in with that little bit of tartness. I'm trying to pick up in which sort of order I get the fruit in. I think it's all together. To say you pick one thing up at a, at a set time in, in drinking it, I don't think you do, but I, I do think you you get it all. Uh, blueberries, again, the biggest sort of uh, flavour in there for me. The cherry sort of feels like it lingers a little bit behind it, just comes in a little bit behind it. And again, the black currant is just sort of there, sort of backing everything up. Uh, what do I think of it? I've got to admit, I do like it. Uh, it's not as sour as I was expecting. That's maybe where they've played it safe. Uh, to maybe get maximum sours. It, if it was too sour, it might not appeal to everyone. I think they've maybe played it a little bit safe. Saying that, the sourness and tartness is still there, and it's still very nice. Yeah, I like it. I do like it. Uh, again, like some of the Vault City beers, they tend to be a little bit safe. Uh, I think this does have a little bit more sourness and tartness than you get from sort of like the Vault City ones from the supermarkets. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, but yeah, I do like this one. I do like this one. And do I think it's worth picking up? I think if you like sours, it's not going to make your, your face scrunch up and, and just suck inside itself. It's not that sort of sour, but nor is it void of any sourness or tartness. Uh, I like it. I think it's pretty decent. Do I think it's worth the money? Five seventy-five. Hard to say. Hard to say. I don't claim to be an expert on sours and cost of sours, uh, but I mean, some high-end sours you can pay an awful lot of money for. You can pay eight, nine, ten, twelve quid for. Uh, so I guess for the quality of the beer, it's probably sort of spot on. So uh, yeah, if you like your sours, maybe give this one a go. Lakes Bruco. Three berry pie, triple fruited sour. I like it. It's one of them that just put a smile on my face. Something a little bit different, enjoyable enough, uh, and I'd recommend it. So uh, there you go. There's my thoughts on this beer from Lakes Bruco. If you've had it before, let me know your thoughts. Uh, give it a go, and then tell me what you think as well, if, if you fancy giving it a go. And Baza, we'll see you again soon on another one. Cheers.